Welcome to this session of my tutorial on calculus. If you are coming across my lecture for the first time, please click the red subscribe button and also turn on the notification bell icon so that you don't miss my upcoming videos. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you. Now, this session I'll be examining quotient rule. Quotient rule. So, when fraction is involved, quotient rule is applicable. So, quotient rule is like u over v. No, u over v is a fraction. So, to differentiate a, a quotient rule, you put the y the x, the formula is the y the s. If you differentiate u, you have 1. 1 times v, so you have v. Since you are differentiating in time of u, you put the u the x. In quotient rule, you separate it with minus. Differentiate v, you have 1. 1 times u, so that will be u. Since you are differentiating with time of u or v, you put the v dx all over v squared. This is the formula for quotient rule. And this formula will be used where fraction is involved. Now, example. If y equals to 3x plus 4 over x is to the power 3 minus 2. Find dy dx. So this is fraction. So you are expected to make use of the quotient rule. So this is the quotient rule. Now, the function is y equals to 3x plus 4 over x is to the power 3 minus 2. You take the numerator, let that be u. The denominator, let it be v. That means you have u equals to 3x plus 4. The denominator, v equals to x is to the power 3 minus 2. x is to the power 3 minus 2. Now, the u, the x. The u, the x. If you differentiate 3x, so it will be 3. 4 is constant. And the derivative of constant is 0. So, the v, the x, the v, the x equals to differentiate 3x squared. Uh, 3x is to power 3. So, you'll be, uh, differentiate x is to power 3, you'll be having 3x squared. And this is constant. The derivative of constant is 0. So, the formula is for quotient rule. We said dy dx, dy dx equal to v du dx minus u dv dx all over v squared. What is v? Back to the function. v is x is to power 3 minus 2. x is to power 3 minus 2. v is x is to power 3 minus 2. Multiply by du dx. Our du dx, du dx is 3. du dx is 3 minus u, u. We have u equals to 3x plus 4. 3x plus 4, that is u. 3x plus 4. Multiply by dv dx. dv, dv dx is 3x squared. 3x squared. All over v squared. Our v is x is to power 3 minus 2. x is to power 3 minus 2. And v is carrying square here. So now let's open the bracket. So 3 times x is to power 3. So you'll be having 3x is to power 3. 3 times minus 2, we have minus 6. 3x squared, no. Just say, let's say minus 3x squared times 3x. So it will be minus 9x is to power 3. Minus 3x squared times plus 4. So it will be having minus 12x is to power 2. All over the denominator x is to power 3 
minus 2 all in square this is carrying 3 as the power and this also have the power of this is also 3 so we have 3 x to power 3 minus 9 x to power 3 that will be minus 6 x to power 3 then we have minus 12 x square then minus 6 you know this and this is what gives me this all over the denominator x is to power 3 minus 2 all in square therefore the y dx equals to this